Hello golfers, Jess Frank coming to you with another edition of Backyard Golf Lessons. Um, just give you a little bit of background about me. I'm a PGA teaching professional, I've been teaching over 20 years. And uh, since this uh, unfortunate situation's happened, I've been posting some golf tips and backyard golf lessons. And today I wanted to talk to you about something that I know could help a lot of golfers. And it's understanding the tilting action of the body or the side bending action of the body. So I have a broom here, makes it real simple. Okay. I also have my golf club, but I'm going to start with the broom. And I know this could help a lot of people. And uh, I see it on the golf course a lot. And basically what I see is when people set up to the ball, they set up, let's say the broom is about here, right? So this is my golf posture. You know, the club would be out in front of me, but I'm in my golf posture right here. Most people, when they swing, they stand up and out of the shot, so the broom never touches the ground. So if you're one of these golfers that when they swing, they stand up and out of the shot, and they hit the ball to the right or they hit it thin, then this would be a phenomenal drill for you. So again, I get in my golf posture. I'm gonna, I can even take the little bit of a tilt back. And then as I come down, I'm going to practice sweeping the ground. And so you can see this as I come down, and the, now the club is hitting the ground every time. So I know this can this can definitely be an effective way to hit the ball a lot more solid. And so if I do it with the face on, or with the, with the looking at me down the line here, you can see how this. So you can see how my body is tilting here. Okay, this is super important, and I do it face on here. Boom. So you can see now is that if I were holding the club, here's the tilt and there's the straight arms, there's the, the handle leading. Um, so this is super important. So as I come down again, I'm going to go back here and I can even go through the shot as well. So you can see is that I'm extended, I'm tilted and I'm turned. But the biggest thing is that we're getting the side bend going through the shot. And again, most people are topping the ball. And so here I got this club here. So now I go ahead and do the same thing and I get myself set up. And now as I swing through, you can see I'm going to hit the ground every time. So I'm going to make a nice little divot here. I have a nice side bend, nice tilt um, to my body. And I know something like this can really help most golfers out there. People are always looking, they're kind of moving out of the shot standing up. Um, and so this is something that could really help you and just learn how to side tilt your body. So I think that by doing this is it creates a lot of different um, angles that you probably haven't felt before. So you have a lot of angles here in your body. And I always like to, I always like to talk about extending, tilting, and turning your body. But this drill with your club right here, like I take this broom and I just go boom, just right back through here. So I'm brushing that grass every time. You know, uh, um, what I also see is as I tilt my body, it's much easier for me to keep my arms straight and the shaft forward. So if I grab my club here and I go ahead and do the same thing, I go ahead back to here and then right through. So you can see is that now every single time I have a bent right wrist, I have a flat left wrist. I have my weight mostly on my front foot. I'm compressing the golf ball. And now look at where my arms are. The majority of players that I see, when they swing, their arms are coming apart. So by side bending and understand how you side bend or tilt, this will give you the ability to hit the ball a lot further. And so it's really simple. You know, if you, if you grab the broom, everybody has a broom, in their house, get into your posture and just practice letting that broom. So you put it kind of right in the middle of your chest and then you just go ahead and boom, right back through. And you'll be shocked at what happens in your swing. You are extending, tilting and turning. You have nice rotation, you get your weight forward. And then from there, it's just very easy to allow your arms to go straight and long. So you're actually propelling your body around in a really good circle too. Um, one of the things that gets a lot of people into trouble is that they swing the club straight back and straight through. So basically what it looks like 
is that they take the club straight back and straight through, and then they pull their arms in, and the club swings too much to the left. So if you're a slicer, this is also a fantastic, fantastic way to cure your slice now, because the key to this here, if I have the club like this, if I put it like this here on my side, and I turn back, look at where this club is coming from now every time. So it's coming from a really nice angle, back down through the ball um, from the inside. Remember, golf is a side on game. So golf can be played, um, for, or golf is played from the side of the ball. So now when I'm doing this here with my swing, I can really get the feeling of, okay, um, you can see how my right shoulder goes underneath my chin. So on the way back, my left shoulder goes underneath my chin, and on the way through, my right shoulder goes underneath my chin. So it's a, it's a foundational uh, movement that can really help your game. So again, my name is Jess Frank. I've been a PGA teaching professional for over 20 years. I teach down here at Deer Creek Golf Club here in South Florida and uh, love teaching, love helping people play better golf. I've been doing these backyard golf lessons now for almost six weeks, maybe seven weeks. Pretty crazy how uh, I think Massachusetts is the last state to open up golf. But um, I know there's there's a lot of driving ranges where you're only allowed to go warm up for 20 minutes and go out and play. And there's a lot of people who still, um, you know, want to stick it out a little bit longer. And so you can go into your backyard, you know, grab this out of your garage or your broom closet and use this. This is a phenomenal way of working on your golf swing. You get so much good, good motion out of here. So you can see here, I'm going to sweep... Sweep that ground every time. So now even if I take this here, I go from here. So you can see as I'm sweeping the ground every time. So I go from here, this way. I feel the same thing. This is really going to help you because like I said, the other part to this is that now the club is swinging on a really shallow angle from behind your body where most people come in and that shaft gets super steep. So the shaft gets over the shoulder and it kind of pulls back. And so you're cutting across the ball. And so this is really giving you the advantage of feeling that. And it's actually a good motion. It's a, you know, the more I do this, the more it starts to pick up on different things. Your pivot gets better. Your arms get better because now they're behind you more. Now you can turn. Now you're going to tilt more coming through the ball. So now you're hitting the ground in the same spot every time, and it's becoming a really easy way to swing the club. So if you're struggling with topping or not hitting the ball solid, um, this is something that could really help you because also what it's doing is you're maintaining the inclination to the ground. And what that means is that most people, they kind of stand up out of the posture, lift their arms, come over the top of the swing. And this, when I set up to it, so here I am in my setup. So imagine the club's right in front of me here. So if I put this right to the side and I just go ahead and tilt my shoulder so you can see I have a phenomenal angle on the way back. Okay. And then as I go back, okay, my main goal is just to sweep the ground with this, with this. So you can see this here. So my main goal is to sweep the ground here. So I'm going to, so you can see is that there, I, I'm not popping up at all. But what I am doing is I'm tilting my shoulders, maintaining my inclination to the ground on an angle, okay? So when I do this now, I'm really working on some good fundamentals that can help you hit the ball a lot more solid. So if this is something you're struggling with, um, I highly recommend it. It also, what, you, what you're also going to learn is that you start to sequence your body with your arms, because this is something that I see a lot with golfers. Golfers will start the club back really fast with their arms. Their club gets really pulled inside. They, they, they stop their turn because as soon as their arms get jammed in, the only place for them to go is to lift the arms up and come over the top. And I see this a lot. This is a, a, a out of sequence backswing. So the club gets behind them, okay, behind the golfer arms lift up and then they come over the top so with this i mean if i could just do it with my club i tilt over here obviously i'm not going to touch the ground with this club but as i turn back here or tilt back i should say tilt extend extend tilt and turn then as i come back down you can see how 
look at where this club's coming from now. So now if I just put this club to do a normal grip and then come back down, I mean, I'm going to, I don't even have to think about it. I'm going to hit that ground every single time exactly where the ball is because now I'm not shifting my weight to the right. I'm not lifting. I'm not getting out of my, out of my posture. I'm moving in a three-dimensional manner. I'm extending, tilting, and turning my body. And so this can help any golfer hit the ball more solid. So if you're struggling with hitting the ball solid and hitting the ball out of the center of the club face, which we're all shooting for, then I would highly recommend that you go ahead and uh, grab your broom out of the broom closet and you go ahead and you start to get yourself tilted here and just keep boom. See, look at this here. I mean, that's really good side bend. My right shoulder is lower than my left. Uh, you know, I'm not like leaping up out of the shot. Uh, so a lot of good things with this drill. So go grab yourself a broom, work on this little motion, this little drill. And I know it can help your game. So thanks again for watching. Please subscribe to the channel. If you really like this video, please go ahead and subscribe, share it with your friends. My goal for my Just Frank Golf Academy YouTube channel is to help as many golfers as I can across the world. And so your support by subscribing and commenting and sharing uh, means the world to me. So I really appreciate it again. Again, Just Frank Backyard Golf Lessons, and we'll talk soon. Have a great day.